Hello. Uh, in this video, we're going to perform the Fisher's exact test uh, in R. Uh, first, you need to make sure uh, the library uh, stats uh, is used. Uh, you have to make sure stats is loaded into R. Uh, and the Fisher's exact test is used to determine whether there are non-random associations between two categorical variables. Uh, Fisher's exact test is usually used when there are very low cell counts, um, and uh, the Peterson uh, chi-square test is not really uh, working. Okay, so remember this. Fisher's exact test is for contention table with very low cell counts. Okay. All right. Uh, to use the Fisher's exact test, first you need to make sure your data is in the contingency table format. Okay. Uh, here, let's do an example. For example, uh, A, B, C, D are cell counts of a two by two table. Uh, let's put it in. Now you, uh, you have a two by two table here. And then the set next step is really, uh, we want to um, perform the Fisher's Exact test is quite straightforward. Uh, just use the, the R function fisher.test uh, and just put in the contents of the table uh, into this function. Uh, you can see here the outputs uh, for the Fisher exact test. It tells you the p value is 0 0.06. Uh, just a little bit over 0.05. Uh, so you may say at level of significance 0.05, uh, the two categorical variables are not associated. Um, and also this uh, um, output contains the 95% confidence intervals. Uh, it does contain one uh, and it's uh, very wide. That's because the sample sizes are really small. Okay, and there's also the odds ratio estimate. Okay. So if you're really interested in learning about the structure of this object, let's see it. Uh, you can see these are all the kind of uh, country uh, attributes. Uh, uh, in this list of seven uh, in the Fisher result, okay? Um, but if you have a question, say, what if, what if we have uh, like a four by two table, not a two by two, we have higher dimensional tables. Uh, actually, if you want to look at the help file for Fisher.test, Uh, you can see actually here um, it has a hybrid and it has a simulate p-value. Uh, the hybrid is a, a logical only used for larger than two by two tables. Um, and then um, the um, simulate p-value is a logical that's uh, it tells you uh, the p-value was computed by Monte Carlo simulation, okay? So if you're interested in doing that, let's do an example here. So this is a four by two table. And let's run the Fisher's test, uh, just here you notice the uh, hybrid equals true and simulate p-value equals to true. And uh, the output is uh, relatively simple. Uh, it just tells you a p-value and tell you the alternative is two-sided. Um, yeah, this is because uh, in this four by two table, uh, there's no odds ratio. Okay, so 
if you look at the structure of this uh, Fisher test result, it's a list of four, so much simpler than the previous one. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching. Uh, sorry, thanks for watching. <laughs>